Tangle and Tress. Tangle is a two-year-old pupil. He's overactive in large play groups, and we've been unsuccessful with really getting him with any dogs for a long period of time. Today we brought him out with just one other dog, placed in separate play yards. We tried some ball work with him, but he's too focused on Triss, so we waited five to eight minutes and let him get his edge off a little bit. We placed Triss in an outside run and then to an adjacent yard. Tangle presented play behavior, but a little tight. This is the first 30 seconds of their interaction. As you can see, it went quick, and you can see that Tango has intense, but awful loose and half body language. Chris is a little tighter, but still did well. Now, the first 30 seconds, at one tenth speed. I let Triss go and at the same time I had Tango on a very short drag lead but it was loose. As Triss approached I simply let the lead go and let Tango go. The thing that you can tell about Tango is even though he's in chase mode his body language is overall pretty relaxed. The tail is flat, the ears are back and and it's even though he's a heavy stocky dog you can tell that his movement is pretty relaxed as he's going and chasing after Triss. Uh, they end up back in that corner, you know, of course behind the tree when you videotape, and they begin to do the dance. Nose to butt, butt to nose, and starting to do the normal meeting ritual. Again, this is what we mess up on Leash to Leash introductions. But what you can see is Tango presents a low, loose body language. And even though the tail doesn't look like it, it is going in that circular fashion. Again, this is the same 30 second intro at 110 speed. Triss is still a little apprehensive, but relaxed. Again, because Tango comes in kind of strong. But remember, Tango is a dog that at the shelter we labeled as a rock dog because we could not in integrate him into large scale play, play groups. Again, Tango's another dog who would benefit from smaller play groups. And my message just said, you can see how his body language, again, it's low, but his weight shifted back. When you see a dog forward and tight, that's when you need to be concerned. But again, the, the dog's move in a kind of a circular fashion and Tango is presenting good body language, good behavior, he's getting himself low. And you can see Triss is a little apprehensive and isn't quite sure what what he wants to do. And this is again, this is three minutes, but it's a 30 second first meet. 30 seconds of a dog-to-dog -dog interaction is so important. Tango comes up, Triss gives nice head language and turns away. Tango actually pays attention to it. What else did you see?